Hello. Early squad, hello. Uh, Blazinski. Uh, plus will mine in Pips, Ghost, Eve, Landon, Alex, Damien. How you guys doing? I'm hoping everything's set up right. I don't think I forgot anything, but I did set up pretty quickly. Ah, uh, wait, no, I don't want to learn agility. Agility is kind of meh. Yo, Eve, how you doing? Old moves. There we go. Hello, Joseph plays. How you doing? Uh, tucked away drowsy. Hi, J-Cat. I just more, uh, what do you call them? Drowsy. Super repel. I don't even know if we'll be using repels during the playthrough. Yeah, Damien was first, I believe. I don't recall seeing anybody else before you. Ooh, another drowsy. It is going well so far. Had some more, uh, leftovers for foods today. Ah, I gotta go buy some more Pokeballs. I ran out yesterday. Uh, Silver Mecha says, I just got Let's Go Pikachu. Cool. How far are you so far? Are you just starting to play right now? I'm doing all right, Landon. How about you? Aquaman. No, no, no. It was more like Useless Aqua from uh, Konosuba. That was the reference because it's a, it's a girl, Gyarados. Speaking of girls, this Drowsy's chilling behind this girl over here. Hello, David. Is that Blos? All right. Remind me to go get some Pokeballs right after this. Getting a lot of EXP, I think it's because of the chain, right? Where am I? I am between the... Oh, God, no. I am between the uh, the third and fourth gyms today. want to see if we can get to Erica's gym and beat her today. But first, I just figured I'd catch more Drowsy because I'm almost at the max chain. No particular reason why I'm... I mean, I could use some extra levels, too, I guess. We could always just battle all the trainers on this route right afterwards and then leave. Hello, Brandon. Uh, Fire Pump says, we can get Tree Chapu Goku. I'm not doing trades until Christmas, man. Sorry. Yeah, I beat uh, Lit Surge yesterday. Yeah, I'm only halfway through the game. So, between third and fourth gym. I'm not like that far ahead. I haven't beaten yet. I'm taking my time with it. Just doing like one gym a day. Whenever I have the time to stream. And there we go. Everybody else leveled up a little bit too. Uh, Chloe, Aqua, and Hamilton. Catching drowsy, them fingers shutters. Yeah, I started catching them yesterday because this is the first thing I ran into this route. And then I figured why not. Uh, yeah, I feel better. I heard another drowsy. Oh, that was a chancy. He's got a really distinct cry. Oh, I should go get Pokeballs. No, no, no. Chancy, get away from me. I'm going to go get some Pokeballs. Uh, this is one of those like ace trainer guys. Ah, uh, what's this? Diglett's cave. So is that where I have to go next? The Diglett cave? I'm not too familiar with Kanto. Good afternoon, Death Whistle. How you doing? Who's this guy? Uh, there are working people out there who use Pokemon to do awful things, stealing other Pokemon, selling them for ridiculously high prices. Uh, Team Rocket. That's where. Okay, that's where they all gather. I'm here to buy, buy, buy. I'm gonna buy them in bunches of, of 10 so that I can get a Premier Ball. Need all the extra Pokeballs. I wish they would just give you extra Premier Balls if you buy more than 10. I think they only give you one.
Honestly, I'm getting sick now. Oh no, did you catch like my half cold slash fever thing that I had the other day? Are you catching Pokemon? Well, buying things to catching Pokemon. No, 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 no. I want 10, not one. I hate that I can't use the directional buttons as directional buttons. <laughs> I'll buy another 20 just to even it out at a uh, 40,000 money that I have. You're crazy, man. Switches are expensive. I can't just be buying them willy nilly. Especially like the full like store ones because they cost a lot. Like 300 bucks for another console when like literally the only thing you really need is like the tablet and the Joy-Cons. Like the, the dock isn't really like, I don't know, like I like playing my games in dock mode just to stream them. But usually I'm playing it in handheld so um, my favorite Pokemon is Latios followed by Lucario. So he's actually my second. Let me go, uh, let me go heal. Your brother is sick too. What did he catch? All right, let's go to, what is it, Diglett Cave I have to go to? It's Christmas now, you know what? Let's just skip Christmas. Happy 2K19, y'all. Why are we skipping Christmas for? Hey, Guardian the Angel, how you doing? It's me, Richard. I just changed my name to show off my uh, minor YouTube channel. I started, okay, cool. Nice of you to show up, though. Good, good to see ya. Did catch a cold, but not the fever. Well, that's good. The fevers are awful, man. I mean, it's not good that you have a cold, but it's better than having a fever. Anyone else see the Lucario that Fallen could have caught? There's no Lucarios in this game, though. Wait, what was that? Oh, he actually survived. What? Who survives the Zippy Zap? What do you think is under Jiglet? I don't know. I never really thought about it too much. I I've seen a lot of wild concept drawings about what could be under Diglett, but I usually just think it's like... I picture it as a little mole. In, uh, in the Mystery Dungeon series, in one of the games, a Skarmory, I think, actually picks a Diglett up and throws him somewhere, but you never get to see the bottom of the Diglett. So it's kind of like a like a tease. So like, wait, what was this all about? Little Mac is the best Smash Bros. 3DS character. I don't like Little Mac. He's very annoying. Too much priority on all of his moves. And they gave him a counter. It's kind of busted. Oh, you will not be surviving a Zippy Zap. You're like level 18, my dude. Well, that's better than Batty Bad, right? Batty Bad was just such a bad name for a move. All the Japanese names are probably like way more lit. I think a cold or worse because we had a fever. Wait, what? So wait, you think a fever is worse than a cold or a cold is worse than a fever? I'm confused. Yo, Mewtwo, how you doing? Machab, let's switch. We haven't used Sora in a while. And Sora does have the type advantage here. I don't even want to look at Elf on the shelf. Picture either a buff big bodybuilder jiggler because why not? Or just the mole, yes. The bodybuilder one reminds me of uh Wait, no, I meant to do I meant to do wing attack, I'm bad. Or I mean that that worked well enough. I was thinking of um 
the bodybuilder thing, I was thinking about Peanut Butter, the Bidoof from the Pokemon Rusty series. Yo, Joshua Herb, how you doing? My first loss, really. I mean, his team wasn't that bad. I've seen worse. Uh, let's go catch some drowsy. Them fingers, though, you're right. Oh, I have 83 Pokeballs. I use this item. You're gonna use your Bulbasaur for what? Smash Bros. Brawler Wii U. Um, to be honest, I feel like I had way way more fun with Brawl, but the the Wii U and 3DS ones, the the connectivity online was a lot easier. So I'd probably go with Wii U based on online, and just in general for the games, I'd like Brawl better. I miss Snake and the old move set that they gave Lucario before. Also, Project M Lucario was really really busted. Even though Project M is now canceled, unfortunately. Take a break from Friend Safari Shiny Hunting Ralts. Uh, good luck, Finny. Uh, Dig Nut Butter, no. Wait, what? He just vanished after I tried to encounter him? Dem knees. Wait, what knees? Are you talking about this Pokemon knees? Yeah, right now I'm only catching these Drazzy for EXP, and maybe if a shiny shows up, that'd be cool. But I think I've leveled up enough. Like, everything went up by like five or so levels ever since we uh, beat Surge. Let people go to some ridiculously high, um, ridiculously high chains and then still don't get like a shiny or something. Alright, are you, are you gonna battle me? Let's go, but don't cheat. I think that's what he said. Blaine or Flannery? Blaine. I don't know in what connotation, but I, I prefer Blaine. So, this Nidorino shouldn't be half ground until he's Nido King, right? So I can hit him with this? Yeah, okay. Where can I buy uh, Electro more clothes, by the way? I'm not sure where I could get more clothes for my partner Pokemon. That's not right. I've never won before. That's not about to change right now. Judgment Wilco. Ooh, he's got a Vulpix. Poor old guy can't win with his Vulpix. At least you can see the shiny in the overworld. You're right. Wow, that Vulpix got melted. I feel so bad. <laughs> Just a little old guy who's never won a battle before. I saw this coming. He has a stroke. Just dies. Rip Wilco. F for respect and chat. Who else is here? Is there anybody else who I can challenge? Okay, coming out with a wrench. Do you use electricity safely at home? Well, I don't put any forks in the electric sockets, if that's what you're asking me. Why is he so angry? I was about to catch this man's Voltorb, or attempt to. It reminds me of a story. Uh, so I used to I used to work in a movie theater, and there was this one time where there was one movie. I think it was like the. Like another 007 or like a spy movie that was going on, but it wasn't doing so hot. So uh, they they canceled the last showing of it at night. And um, they canceled the last showing of it at night because there was like not enough people showing up. Where I don't even know if anybody showed up to the to the premiere of it. Or not a premiere because it wasn't the first time they were showing it. It was like towards the end of its run. 
but they canceled that showing and put something else in that theater and then i had this really 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 old uh guy come up to the uh you know to the place where the, you get the ticket the, the ticket box thing and he's just like uh, like i want to i want a ticket to see the uh the spy movie thing i forgot what it was called but he basically just said that but like a really breathy voice because the man looked like he was out of breath and he was on like a little bit of a what do you call it uh those little those little like walker machines not like it's not like the ones with like you know you walk with but it's actually like automated so he kind of like drove up to the thing and he's like yeah i'd like to i like a ticket here and i was just so sad because he, he looked like he couldn't even get the words out the man looked like he was about to die any second <laughs> and i'm just like yo sorry fam the uh the show is canceled so and he just looks so disappointed and i felt so bad for him he didn't get to watch his movie <laughs> Uh, I gotta go soon because I need to do some more of my big history project. Oof, that doesn't sound so fun, but good luck with your history project. Back to school on Monday, yeah. Uh, let's switch. Let's switch into... Hey, Dracolor, he has got good special defense. Uh, sure, sure, Richard. Hit me with that young trivia. I already battled this guy randomly. What about you? I'm the strongest among my friends. The Nintendo Switch in Australia. How much is the Nintendo Switch in Australia? If you can convert that to US dollars. Your favorite Z move type and sandwich. Uh, so Z move, I'd probably have to say. Trying to think of all the ones I usually use in battle. I like the steel one and the psychic one. Trying to think of any others that I've actually used in battle. The water one's alright, the fire one's alright. Most of the time I use steel and. Uh, steel and psychic, I'd say. Those are my favorite Z moves. The. Favorite type. I'd still go with dragon, then steel, then like fairy. Uh, sandwich. What? What was my favorite sandwich? Yeah, hello, storm. Last Tomoe, what is this, mommy? I'll just stay in. I forgot what it was. Oh, I'll need arena. I drink to forget, but I always remember. What do you always remember? Did it with Thunderbolt.
So what's this way anyways? Or did I have to go into the Diglett Tunnel? I can't remember. Hello, Zana. Lamather Town. So, wait. Am I supposed to be going this way or going through the Diglett? Hello, Nitro. How you doing? What is this way? Route 12. Oh, Snorlax is here. I can't go around him. When that happens, is this not the time or place for me to be going? I guess not. I'll just go back. Let's just go back to the Diglett thing. I remember that Misty was saying we should probably be going that way anyways. There's so many drowsy everywhere. <laughs> I want to catch some of them. I'm just not going to learn agility. There's no reason to. Took the Snorlax with a wooden spoon. I mean, that's what my mom does to me. <laughs> that's so sad. Um, Are you good, though? Like, does she, does she hurt you with that wooden spoon or what? <laughs> Did you get used to it? Tiny Drowsy. I'm pretty sure I have, like, every size of Drowsy by now. Pikachu, not Pike. Never get used to it if she uses a different one every time. Get used to what? Oh, what's this? Entirely by one Diglett or by like all Diglett together? What's new? Not much. We just beat the um, the third gym leader, so now we're down here. A Diglett would be nice to have, but I don't want to break that chain I have. There's no point in really catching anything at the moment. I'd rather just walk through here, battle some trainers that are here inevitably because this is part of the story wait there's nothing following me because um i was too big now who haven't we had follow us in a while let's have uh take damien out of the pokeball i wonder if you'll be one of those pokemon that tries to walk in front of me or always behind me oh it's a duck trio Okay, there's a uh, Chansey. How have you been doing? I've been doing all right. Uh, that's another Diglett. I thought that was like an item for a second. I've heard that there's a tunnel even darker inside than this one somewhere. Somewhere out there. I mean, yeah, granted, there should be a darker tunnel somewhere. That was a really quick uh, passage. Where am I now? Wait, Route 2. Diglett Cave. There must be something back here, right? There's no reason they would put this. Ah, there we go. This is an item. So wait, am I back like... This is my pewter, right? What am I supposed to be doing here? I'm gonna save just in case I, uh, there's like a ledge or something that I have to jump over. And then I can't like backtrack.
too bright out here. Okay, what is he gonna show us now? This is too bright outside. We can cut this down though. Uh, pewter. <laughs> yeah. It's like that, uh, the Nevi thing. Anyways, I guess this guy wants to show us something. I'm not sure if it's, uh, story related or what, but we'll go check it out. Secret technique light up. Oh, it's basically flash? That your Pikachu is special. Fascinating. Let me try to teach it. Let me turn off the lights again. Calm your heart, breathe deeply, and sense your surroundings. I don't think any of that was actually necessary. Uh, do you want a Melton? That'd be cool to have a Melton, because I don't have Pokemon Go, but I'll try to get one later on, I guess. Right now, I just want to finish the story stuff. Rock Tunnel Review's Secret Technique, a Light Up. If you head east from Cerulean City, I have to go back to Cerulean City and then head east. I don't know how to breathe. <laughs> oh, what are you doing here? Wait, so like the people are supposed to learn this? That's this direction to the right. All right, I guess he's helping us out. Oh, this is where that tree leads to when I was in Cerulean. I was like looking around and I was like, hey, what is this all about? Yeah, I don't really remember the Kanto games too much. Oh, there's a Firo there. That's interesting. Oh, she's got an Eevee. That's cute. We're using too much Zippy Zap lately. Go back to good old Thunderbolt. Wait, what? A Tail Whip? What just happened? The Tail Whip not work? Ah, this isn't gonna do that much. What is your favorite uh, taunt? Like villagers dance? Um, oh, you meant taunt, not taunt. Uh, favorite taunt? I've been using a lot of uh, Mario lately, so I'd say the one where he gets huge and then you know comes back down to normal size. Like that taunt. I also like the um, taunt that Ganon has, where he pulls out his sword for like a second and then puts it away again. It's like ah, I don't need this sword to beat you. Wow, the trainer battles really don't give that much EXP. It's just the catching in chains that does. Ash got Buizel from Dawn. <laughs> yeah, he did get it from Dawn. Hiker Jeremy. Oh no, that's not good. I gotta switch out. <laughs> Electro can't take down Onyx. I don't have double kick anymore. I 
I still have Hamilton though, and he does have a grass move. Unfortunately, I don't have any special grass moves like Solar Beam or something. Wish I had access to a special grass type move like Absorb or something. However, that did do a lot of damage. That Vine Whip by itself. Who is Brock's strongest Pokemon? I mean, a really iconic one he had was the Steelix, no? Yeah, we just talked about that earlier today, actually. Yo, Neko! Haven't seen you in a while, how you doing? Who is Misty's strongest Pokemon? Didn't she have a Gyarados at a time? Like, after the little time skip thing that she had where she, like, left and then she, like, visited or something, or they found her? She had a Gyarados. I'd say that that would be one of her strongest Pokemon. Oh wait, that's still ground type. I should probably start switching out to something else. Can we teach can we teach Aqua any water moves at this point? Any TMs or something? What a savage! Well that was the freest win Hamilton's ever had. Another Geo, dude. You think he'll, uh. You think he'll self destruct again? Hello, Sparf Discovery. How you doing? Oh, he got one shot. Yeah, because there's no sturdy in this game. Sorry, had hockey. It's all good. How'd you do in hockey? Would anyone like to join a heist with Finny? I'm gonna keep battling. You have three Geo, dude. Was your strat to just use three self destructs? I'm at 164 soft resets for a shiny Fennekin and I'm about to give up TBH. You should keep on going. 164 soft resets is still relatively early, even though the starter soft resets are a lot longer than the uh, regular Pokemon like encounters, like legendaries and stuff. I hope you keep on going to at least like maybe 250, and then if you want to quit afterwards, and I guess that's alright, but 164 is a little bit early. Try to go at it for a little longer. I almost go to my corner and be depressed. Oh no. Yeah, you could suffer it for a good nature at least. That's not so bad. But 620 in for Giratina. Why does everyone have ground type Pokemon here? Okay, I guess I'm switching into um switching into Aqua. This is the first time Aqua's had in battle. Oh my god, that's terrifying. How is Sand Attack working on me? I'm a flying type. Let's use Bite. Hi, Mike. Oh wait, did I miss? I saw the uh, the blue bars of the overlay go down, and I thought that that was Aqua's health, and I was gonna be really, really sad <laughs> that she got one shot by Fury Swipes. Oh, that did pretty well. Nice. I'm gonna try Rage, because if it uses Fury Swipes on me again... Then I should get my... Oh, I'm getting my attack up! Yes! This is gonna be ridiculous in a minute. Wow, okay, so Rage on Aqua is gonna be great. My attack power just doubled. 
and it keeps on avoiding the attack, and you know, hitting me with sand attack, that's not good. Even if Rage misses, though, my attack will keep on going up, so that's good. Now, if only I can hit something with it. Oh, like this. He's not hitting me. This Sandshrew, man. Thunderbolt Aqua, no. We got destroyed. I'm sorry to hear that, Shadow. Wait, I just got an idea for double battles. What do you have? Aqua's doing so well, despite not being able to hit any moves. And her attack is almost maximized at this point, so we're just going to go for the bite. Oh, that hits. That Yeah, that's a lot of damage. Bye, Santru. Thanks for playing. Eradicate. Now I'm keep I'm keeping Aqua in to destroy this Eradicate. I like all the animations of the Pokemon so far. They're really cool. Oh, I use Bite and it uses Crunch. I hope I don't miss the next two, or else I will faint. Oh, and that has Quick Attack. That was a crit. Wow. <laughs> Deleted. That's that's Blue's Radicate all over again. Yeah, how the exams go, Mike? I remember you said something about it before. Did you do well? Or do you think you did well if you haven't gotten the results back yet? Can't measure up. Want to play Smash with you? Yeah, I was with my friend and he just wanted to do a 1v1. I asked him if uh, he wanted to let you in. My bad. Sometimes we just like playing 1v1s. Yeah, but it is, uh, it's alright so far. I've had some leftovers from Thanksgiving because I, I love turkey, man. Like, it's, I have a problem with, with turkey. Whenever Thanksgiving rolls around, I just, I love the leftovers foods. Uh, I saw my question right, sorry. No, 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 I didn't see your question. I, I actually didn't. I was waiting for you to say any trivia, but I didn't see you tag me in any comment before, so I might have missed it. Hello, Yoshi and friends, how you doing? Uh, Big Daddy D says... Bruh, I was being sarcastic how after 14,000 soft resets, when I found normal EV, I like... Dude, if you're that unlucky, I don't know what to say to you. If you, uh, went 14,000 soft resets and can't even get the right nature of a Pokemon that you want. Back to talking about Pokemon Black and White 3. Uh, like I said, my day's been all right so far. I said I was I was enjoying some uh, leftovers from Thanksgiving before. I don't know if you heard me. My, my mic might be acting up or something. It's doing good, and you? I'm also doing well, Yoshi. Thank you for asking. Uh, vine whip on this boy. Wait, burrowed? Ah, oh, no, not this. Well, I don't think that'll hit me that hard, so I'm just going to hit him with the vine whip when he comes back up. I do resist that. <laughs> Served. I don't know, man. The uh, the vine whip just looks like he's uh, throwing hands, like the uh, the roasting palms, but it's like a karate chop with the with the vine. Whip that diglet. Hi, Lucy. How you doing? Oh, that's a Fero. We don't want to deal with that. We're just gonna throw Electra out there and hopefully Zippy zap that thing away. So wait, are a lot of people still doing Wonder Trades in Ultra Sun and Moon? Because I know not everybody wanted to get the Let's Go games. And technically, Ultra Sun and Moon is still the latest Pokemon game of the main series. So how many of you still play Ultra Sun and Moon on a regular, or are you guys doing anything else in the older games? Uh, what if we get a 500 Dono? If I get a 500 Dono, um, <laughs> how many debits would that be? <laughs> Let's see, if it's 2,000 per dollar, that's times two is a thousand, and then times, uh, a thousand times a thousand is a million, so it'd be like two mil, two mil, uh, Nevits. You definitely have, by far, the most Nevits out of anybody. Still playing Ultra Sun, me too. Uh, hello to that sudden question, me. Hello, Luxury Guardian, how you doing? Haven't seen you in a while, man. How you been? May I still play regular, son? 
Yeah, some people didn't even bother getting the Ultra Sun and Moon games. I mean, they're good games. Oh, wait, what? Wait, are you that nearsighted? I actually had to walk up to him to fight him. I like the story of regular Sun and Moon from what I've seen more than the Ultra Sun and Moon, but the extra features with the wormholes and stuff is just so cool in Ultra Sun and Moon. Also, the uh, saving with the Y button in the in the start menu is very, very useful. I thought it was just a really dumb feature, but no, it's very useful. Been hunting shinies in Ultra Sun and Moon Nitro or in another game? Uh, on games, you know any hidden gems? What systems do you uh, do you like playing on? Uh, Jesus, like 3DS and Switch, or wait, Dragon Rage? Ooh, that is a strong move. That is a strong move right now. That'll be a lot better than Ember. And you know what? It'll be a lot better than Smoke Screen. I still like to have Ember as a little fire type attack that we could use against something that's weak to fire. But yeah, if you tell me what consoles you have, I might be able to recommend something. If you um. Uh, what's the word? What's the word? What's the word? If you uh, if you have any genres of games you like playing, you know, I know you like Smash, so like maybe Fighters is a, a good thing for you. But I don't know what other types of uh, games you like. I could probably recommend something, but I hope you like it. And if not, you could probably always return it. I don't know what, what uh, GameStop's return policies are like, actually. I think if you return it within, like, seven days, you get all your money back. Hearing here when a crossbow went from level 50 to level 60. Um, he leveled up in the new games? I thought he went from, like, 70 to 60 or something. I thought he went down. I never thought he leveled up. I know his catch rate went from like 3 to 255 or something. Like really ridiculous catch rate. And that was kind of upsetting. Yo, Mike. You said you donated 30 a while ago. When? Oh, snap. I didn't even see that. What is up with my notifications? I am so sorry. Yeah, I, it didn't even pop up. But thank you, man. How did your chest go? I didn't see I didn't see any comment about that. I was looking for you earlier when uh, you came back and people were asking you how it went. But yeah, if anything, just message me on Discord because it'd be it'd, it'd be cool to see um, how that went. I'll hit you with your nibbits right after I finish this battle. Uh, will you switch your Pokemon? Uh, switch Pokemon. Keep battling. I'll keep battling. Nice to see you again, though. Playing Pokemon Snap. But that means I gotta update the goal, man. Hold up. Where's is it here? No. My labels are right here. Yeah, I don't know. My, my notifications ever since I've been like messing around with them have been acting up a bit. So I am so sorry that that didn't even show up. It didn't even show up on my stream labels until I refreshed it right now. Uh, do you like Shino Numa? I don't know what that is. You're crazy. Yo, Frank! Son, how have you been? It has a Clefairy. What has a Clefairy? Ultra Highest, Dono Gold Reach. Yeah, I'll do an Ultra Highest too. Why not? Oh, she gave me two Great Balls. We need a shiny theme song. What do you mean? Like a song that plays when shiny show up or what? Here we go. Alright, you have 17k right now. And then that's... There we go. Nebits are all good. Now I just gotta set up an Ultra Heist for everybody. Let's see, are the heists working right now, or is it going to be on cooldown? Let me try again. Hmm. It might be on cooldown. Alright, plus all mine, and tag me in your comment XM so I can actually see it. I feel like the Ultra Heist is on... I feel like the Ultra Heist is on uh, cooldown right now. 
Uh, yo, Crimson, can you start an ultra heist once it uh, once it goes off and let me know when it happens? In the meantime, I'll give everybody a reward for the ultra heist since we did reach the donation goal and we can have a really big one after this. Oh, I jumped the wrong way. Well, actually, either way I jumped, I just I don't get anything, so I'll just go back around. I'll ask a different question. In episode uh, date expectations, which Pokemon appears prominently as well? Wait. As well as a shiny variant hit the episode as in the Advanced Generation series. A shiny variant and a regular variant. Advanced was like a, a region that I liked, but I never got to see much of the anime, unfortunately. Where am I supposed to be going? Is it this way? Ah, yeah, it is this way. I, I think I know what episode you're talking about, but I can't remember what Pokemon it was. But I, I remember seeing an episode where like shinies would show up uh, randomly. Right, we, we don't want to run into that. I'm still like, I still got a little bit of like, um, what's the word? A little bit of anxiety when I'm walking into the grass because I'm like, I don't want to run into anything right now. But I'm like, wait, you can only run into things if you'd like so choose to because... Oh, I found a super lure. Swallow, really? It was Swallow? Didn't uh, didn't Winona have a shiny Swallow? What's the name I give to a shiny UXC you hunted? Ah, uh, man, that is a long time ago that UXC, we've done UXC. Who is this guy? Wait, what? Oh, God, we're surrounded. Yo, where's Risen? Oh, they're going to exact their revenge. I am surrounded. Oh, hello. Who be this? Tashigakita. Yo, Nat, what's up? Oh, snap. She's so bad. I really like Lorelai's design in this game. 3v1-ing. Can you take that other one for me? Sure. He's like so... Unfazed by this, he's like, alright, just beat me already. Correct answer is Dawn Fan. There was an episode with regular Dawn Fan and Shiny Dawn Fan? So like was it like a couple of Dawn Fan? Like, you know, a male and female Dawn Fan? I love Lapras's face, it's so smug. Did I just get healed? I have all of my zippies out back. Did the game just auto heal me without telling me? Or did, did I actually get healed in the last like 10 minutes and I never even paid attention? Uh, thank you. See you, Dad. I'm off once again. Take care, man. Thank you for dropping by. Visiting your old man. Wait, Thunder. Forget an old move. While I do enjoy the power of Thunder, I don't enjoy the lack of accuracy of Thunder. So we're just gonna tuck that away and... Keep my old moves. BRB, my dog needs food. Alright, feed the doggo. What if the boss hears about this? You're fired, man. I am here from Hero Aka. Yeah, that is exactly where it is from. That's a lot of electric moves. I can't I can't even look at a ground type. She's Lorelei. All caps. Elite 4, we surrender. GG. Collecting gym badges. Yeah, I'm coming for you next, girl. Would anyone like an online battle? Uh, Guardian says, in short... Wait. Uh, question 2, in the short, Pikachu's vacation. Who were the four Pokemon that approached Pikachu? And Carol, bonus, which one was the leader? This is a re-ask. Huh. Pikachu's vacation. Yeah, we have a new emote, uh, Mike. Nice of you to notice the little Lily one. Pikachu's vacation. Do you know uh, what movie was that from? If you can, if you can tell me that, I forget which uh, which movie it was. Was that the first movie one? Oh God! Why is that Windows notification so loud? It's Team Rocket. They give up so easily, but I, I feel like that was also a thing in like the old games. Like if anybody strong showed up, they'd just be like, nope, we're out. Bye. So like, is cutting down this tree solely just to ignore this trainer? Like, is that all it's for? 
I'll just battle him. I don't even care. Pokemon the first movie. Okay, yeah, so then that was the one with, um... That was the one where Charizard got his head stuck in the pipe, right? Oh, you're the one that wanted his Goldie. All right. A couple of people said Goldie, too, so that's why I'm like... I can't remember most of the names that uh, Yuxi... People suggested for Yuxi, though. Oh, okay, that wasn't my computer. Yeah, no, it wasn't yours. It was me. I wish I could shut it down. Like, I've tried to actually shut down the notifications. They just always sound, and it's, like, really annoying when it happens during a stream. Psyduck is about to get roasted. So, yeah, I can't remember which Pokemon approached Pikachu and his friends. I forgot what the argument was even about. I just know that Charizard ended up being stuck in a pipe, right? Is it just me or do Pikachu's ears go through the hat? Uh, some normal amount of clipping would be uh, expected from a game like this. Model clipping is just a thing that always happens in games because they don't make the models like 100% perfect. Or keep in mind all the interactions. I mean, there could be holes in the hat or it could just be clipping through. I don't, I don't know. If anyone has a cool name for a male crocodile, type in chat. Call him Vector. Even though he's not a crocodile, he's uh, there's like an alligator, I think, character in Sonic. And he's Vector, and he's this big old buff alligator. Yeah, he, you can play him in Sonic Heroes for the first time. That's the first time I ever heard of him and saw him in a game. Might be getting a Switch for Christmas. Awesome Pikachu Punch. What games do you have in mind? Anybody who doesn't have a Switch yet, are you guys thinking about getting it for Christmas? And if so, what games would you like to get for the Switch? I know a lot of people will probably just get it uh, early so they can have a Switch for when the next generation of Pokemon comes out. Oh, Primeape, hello. Why? <laughs> he looks ready, man. He's always angry. I think there was a thing in his Pokedex entry where, like, some of them apparently get so angry that they die. And the only time you ever see a peaceful expression on his face is once it's dead. The only good game Xenoblade. Xenoblade 2, you mean? I haven't played the original Xenoblade for more than, like, a couple of hours. Oh god, what is that face? Way to go, youngster. Onesan over here is into the younger boys. Gave you Brick Break. I don't know if that's supposed to be an innuendo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Teach my Pokemon Brick Break. Yes, I understand. Let me go see if I can teach anybody Brick Break, actually. Where is my... DM case. There we go. Ooh, Scald. I gotta teach Scald to... to Aqua so she's not as useless. We're forgetting Splash. We don't need this move anymore. You know the drill. Wait, what drill? I only have a B drill. The answer was Raichu, Meryl, Cubone, Snubble, Bonus. The leader was Raichu. By the way, did you know that Primeape were the reason Pokeballs were created? Really? Enlighten me. I remember that in the anime, the Mankey threw a rice ball back at Ash and he caught a rice ball in his Pokeball. Um, wait, Electra can learn Brick Break? Huh. Ooh, Chloe can also learn Brick Break. But what, what, is it, what am I supposed to hit with Brick Break exactly? Uh, Focus Energy, Rage. I don't know what I'm supposed to be hitting with Brick Break. But I will teach Brick Break to Damien. I said a Seismic Toss. I'd rather not have two moves that do, like, flat damage. I get it. Aqua is useless. Get it. Yes. Uh, Dig? What can learn Dig? Oh, Electric can learn Dig. That's kind of cool. Everybody can learn Headbutt. That's amazing. Well, if there's any uh, random weak move that I don't want anymore. Wait, what is uh, Damien have? Damien's going to be, like, my TM guy. 
Yeah, no, no, no. Screw Fury Swipes. We're going to go for a headbutt. I do need Brick Break, to be honest, against Rock Types. Uh, let's try it. I don't know what I'm going to delete. I don't want to delete Double Team because it's like such a dumb move, but like Thunder Wave is useful. I, I, that's my problem. I don't know what to delete. So if you can think of anything, which move I should delete for Brick Break on Electra, let me know. And I'll consider doing that. Whatever move you think will have the least amount of utility. Oh, God. You want to use Secret Technique Light Up? Yes, please. I wonder, like, during a Nuzlocke challenge, you have to navigate through this entire uh, cave. There's Charmander in here? And Onyx. Oh, God, he looks scary. This is a good place to catch Pokemon. Nice. Did I go into the wrong area or what? Because there's there's no way to proceed. It's just a... Uh, just a re oh, wait, no. I missed something. I'm blind. That Onyx is very huge. Wait, I thought I ran into something else. Just try to chomp me. Aw, oh, come on, dude. Let's give him a raspberry. Maybe he's hungry. Oh, God. Are you serious? My guy. That should have been, uh, like, one of the combo ones. Onyx hitbox is massive. You'll have moments when you think it's safe to pass, but you can't. I just want to throw more Pokeballs at once. What are those emotes, Crimson? What is that? Oh, God. Try a Great Ball. I have a hundred Pokeballs. Hello? That first one almost got it. It was three shakes and everything. Maybe the great will do it. If this doesn't work, I'm just running from it. I don't need this Onyx. Okay. <laughs> the second I say that, he's just like, oh, all right, fine, fine, fine. I'll, I want to be captured. I just got to hit him with that reverse psychology. The mystery is history. A legendary was shown. Do you have a baby form? Which one is it? The only time I ever remember any legendary having a baby form was uh, Lugia. Yeah, see, I thought I hit the Geo dude, but I hit the giant Onyx instead. What should I name my Meta Gross? Um, name him after a supercomputer. Do, does do you guys know of any supercomputers that have names in anime or something or in shows? Uh, Meta Gross is basically like a super duper computer. You know what would be funny if you named them Karen after the computer that uh, Plankton married. <laughs> I know Metagross is, uh, doesn't, don't, ha don't have gender, but it'd just be funny if you named them Karen, like Plankton's wife. Hundred and fourteen EXP points. Let's go, Maniac. What game? Are you good? What is that face? Is he trying to like cosplay Slowpoke? Karen the Metagross. Oh, hello, Machop. Karen is best Metagross. Have a Joltik to be Plankton. Is there any other Pokemon that has, like, one eye? Oh, God. These are scary. I want that tiny Cubone. Give me that tiny Cubone. After seeing that face just close the game, yeah. He was in not he was not even ready. He was about to hit me and then he just got captured. Yeah, it's a tiny onyx. Dude, reading over all the numbers of the tiny Pokemon and the big Pokemon must be ridiculous. A friend of mine told me that his Articuno was apparently like three foot ten and he was the tiny Articuno. So I'm just like, dude, that Articuno's like literally half my size. Three feet. What do you mean? 
Can you guys picture a three foot tall Articuno? Like, obviously his wingspan would be huge, but it's still a three foot tall Articuno. Oh, I have to wide berth the Onyx. I have to go around him. So hard though, because I want to run into him and I just wanted a tiny Cubone. Oh, hello there, Kangaskhan. My sister caught an inch tall Cubone. These numbers are ridiculous. We need to make some videos on this. What, fake out? What, what? This guy is so meta. Smoggin Incarnate. Why am I flicking my, my control? This game has conditioned me to flick at any Pokemon I see as if I'm about to capture it and I'm in a battle instead. Uh, Jameson says, Crimson Fire is the best at making names. What names did you come up with now? I wasn't paying attention. But like, isn't it funny that Kangaskhan are born with baby Kangaskhan in their, uh, in their pouches? The only chance he's always born with an egg, so like you get an egg and an egg within an egg in the Chansey. This is so creepy. Can we get an emote of this? What is that supposed to be? What face is that? Ooh, Golbat. Golbat. I feel like we should catch that tiny Onyx. Just what? You're all mouth, my guy. Oh. What? How did that? At least he didn't try to fight it. Don't bring up the paradoxes about about what? I found a tiny Moltres, but ran out of Pokeball, so I settled for the normal size one. Sad. How do I throw it over? I am not that strong. Hello, Golden Glaceon. Thank you for blessing us mortals with your presence. And that was not a good thing at all. Let me go throw a raspberry at this guy. He just ate it. I feel like I hit the back of his throat because it hit the black part of his mouth and then it like flew back at me. Oh, the Kangas kind of chance of having their young, basically. That's a paradox grade stuff, I swear. It's like the Penbro steps of Pokemon. <laughs> An endless cycle. <laughs> Reminds me of this thing in, uh, we were watching Shaolin Showdown the other day. And there was this one Shengang Wu that can turn anything back to what it used to be before. So Jack uses it on a chicken and he's like, time to answer the age old question. What came first, the chicken or the egg? And so the chicken turns back into an egg and it just stands there like on the table or the counter, whatever he had it on. And then <laughs> you think, oh, well, you know what? The answer was the egg. No, the egg turns back into a chicken and starts walking off the table. And then it turns back into an egg and rolls. Then it turns back into a chicken and walks more. And the chicken is just spazzing out every two frames that he keeps turning back into an egg. And back into a chicken, so like that's gotta be really weird. And it just kept, it kept cycling in and out of egg and chicken form while it like exited the screen. So like for all we know, there's just some random chicken that constantly goes back to being an egg and vice versa, just running around. It's gotta be some uh, funny existence. We got the tiny, tiny onyx. All right, so no more of that. Tiny graveler. I don't know what it is it with me. Does anybody else have a problem with catching the tiny or big Pokemon? Like, something about them being a different size just makes you want to capture them. That was bad. I forgot how weird that show was. Oh my god, it's great. Which one of Ash's Pokemon is shiny? Noctowl. I believe that's the only one he ever caught. I think it's funny that they started saying, oh, it's a shiny color, and then, you know, the, the shiny term stuck there. Oh, God, Rhydon. I encountered a wild rock. 
I've encountered a wild Rhydon that I would like to cap. Sure. So I captured this in that hard in this game. I can't believe that a lot of people just have to go at it with two people. I, th I feel like shiny hunting with two people would be fun though, because you'd have a higher catch percentage. Can legendaries run away from you in this game, by the way? Do they also have a chance of running? So weird how Ash doesn't know what a shiny is, right? They just always refer to them as like rare Pokemon. Hold on. Alright, my bad, I had to uh, do a thing real quick. Ah, uh, he said, I don't have a low in Vulpix and it's kind of enough to trade. Level must be 15 to 20. Why are you looking for a specific level for Vulpix? By the way, does anybody know if you trade like a uh, regular Kanto Vulpix for an Alolan Vulpix in this game using the in-game Alolan trade guys? Uh, what happens if your Pokemon has a nickname? Does the other Pokemon also get the same nickname? Because if not, then all the Alolan Pokemon, you just can't nickname them at all. And that's kind of unfortunate. You know what? Wait, why do I even want this? I already have one of these. Wasting my Pokeballs. Oh god, that Onyx is terrifying. Let me just pick this Dire Head up real quick. Let's see what you want. Can you beat my power? Probably. You don't seem so tough, you're just doing a random kick. Oh, of course, you have an Onyx. Which means I'm gonna have to switch out because I actually can't damage you at all. Let's see if Aqua can clap you with the youngest of Scalds. Unless I get hit with a Rock-type move like immediately after coming out. Reach. Oh god, that is awful. What? That screech actually looks like the one in the anime that Rourke did. Oh yeah, no, that is a dead onyx. There's no way it's surviving this. Good job, Aqua. Said before, but you went away. Legendary is in certain Pokemon you have to defeat in a five minute timer to try to catch them as normal Pokemon. But can they run away though? I mean, if you do defeat them in five minutes, can they run away when uh, when you're trying to catch them as normal Pokemon? And if so, do you get another chance, or is it just gone forever? I feel like they're very forgiving with the legendaries uh, this time around. Like, ever since Gen uh, 6 came out, they've been like, oh, if you don't catch a legendary, you can always just go back and try again. They cannot from what I've seen. Damien, are you good? Sniffing at the ground. Got three great balls to replace the ones I've been using. All right, thank you, Luffy, for the info. I always thought that clicking A on these, like, trickling water spots would give you something, but no. They're just there for show. And what? Wait. Oh, so I could go around either direction and just, um... Let's... Bag. No, no not bag. Party... Pokemon... Have uh, Damien in the front. Oh, that was cute. Wait. Playing with Electro like this is really weird because uh, 
For whatever reason, the left Joy-Con's gyroscope is really weird. It doesn't want to work easily. Like, look at that. I'm barely moving my hand, but it's like going across the entire screen. If you run from, uh, from either fighting them or catching them, you will have to try to find them in the wild as a rare wild Pokemon spawn. Which would be like Chansey or another certain shape Pokemon, but even then it's a low chance. Okay, so then don't do that. Is it another specific route or... So they basically become rubbing Pokemon? What's a good thing I have Brick Break? Stealth Rock? Smoggin? Hit him with Dragon Rage. Wow. Specific routes, yes, but I don't know them on the top of my head. Okay. That seems a lot more convoluted than just catch them on the first try, as usual. What Pokemon did you have here? Onyx. All right, take care, Golden Glacian. Thank you for dropping by the stream tonight. Hope to see you around some other time. Go for Brick Break again. I did a good amount of damage. All right, we're going to cheese this Onyx. Switch it into Aqua. That's why I say before I try to catch them, so much easier than having to hunt them down. Doesn't affect Aqua. Indeed, I am above the ground. I You cannot hit me with that move. That powerful Scald! This cave is a lot longer than I remember. In the manga, the electric tail of Pikachu, there is a higher level haunter known by what name? Bonus, what? When it refused to be caught, what did it do to escape? Didn't it self destruct? I don't remember what name they gave it. But I remember that there was a really crazy and super extra haunter that literally killed itself in order to not be caught. I don't know if we're thinking about the same thing, or I imagine that, but I believe the Haunter either self-destructed or did something where it just, like, it GG'd itself. As for what the name was, I've read it before, but I can't remember what it was called. So, was that, was that what happened to it? You'll probably tell me all the details soon. Unfortunately, with the manga, like, while it is a really cool, uh, cool extra medium for the Pokemon franchise, I've only ever, I've only ever read the Ruby and Sapphire chapters. The answer is the Black Fog, and you are right on the bonus. It you self destruct. <laughs> Yeah, it's just like, you can't catch me if I'm not in front of you. Wait, was that a Poliwhirl? Oh, no, I didn't want to fight that. I am at a serious disadvantage currently, so I'm just going to use Dragon Rage twice. Yeah, that'll do it. Bubble Beam is such a weird attack. Like, who gets hurt by Bubbles, man? You can't catch what's not alive, boo. I mean, he's already a ghost. But then again, like, are ghost Pokemon alive? Are they actual ghosts? Or, like, what's the deal with them? Like, that's some more controversy for Pokemon. Fired away. He looks so done. No! Oh! Why do you spawn there? I just wanted to walk. Oh wait, did I did I just go in there twice? That was my bad. Oh god, your hitbox is ridiculous. Get off my screen, Onyx. 
Oh, this is interesting. I haven't seen one of these yet. It zooms in on the baby. Oh, it's gonna jump away. That was a pretty easy throw. Oh, wow. A lot easier than catching Golbat and all those other Pokemon. And Ableton's on level 30. Wow, all my Pokemon are close to 30 now. Wow, Onyx has like no HP, hello? These hikers using their stealth rock. Oh, that's really cool how it disappears like that. Stealthy rocks. I have to go use uh, Chloe again for Poison Jab. I really want to try out that move. I haven't used it yet. Yeah, Shadow. Uh, good luck on getting your shiny, man. Gotta get that Scald. Scald is such a good move, man. The fact that they made a water move that can burn... Pin Missile. How strong is Pin Missile? Uh, it's two to five times in a row. Oh, it, it's at least as strong as Twin Needle, if not better. Twice in succession by jabbing it with two spikes this may also poison. The problem is it has better accuracy, but you know I'll take the chance of being a lot stronger. And hitting more times. Over the poison chance. He's up. What am I doing? Which way is out? <laughs> Are you lost, fam? I just want to get out of this cave at this point. Oh, no, Damien. Don't talk to me. I just want this Pokeball. Hey, bro. That would probably throw me back to the beginning of the cave, right? In the same manga, the Electric Tail of Pikachu. What did Misty wish for while in the spa? Japanese version only was translated to English eventually. That I don't know at all. <laughs> like I said, the only manga that I know of a little bit more is the Ruby and Sapphire chapters. Dragon Rage only has 10 PP. I thought I had way more. Did they just nerf it in this game? Goodbye, Machop. I forgot, what Pokemon does this guy have now? Was it a Rhyhorn? Rhydon. Wait, no, Rhyhorn. Okay, I thought it was Rhydon for a second. Uh, that, that is too early for you to have a Rhydon. Can you get Rhydon in this cave, like as a rare encounter? Gotta love them sell a buy. You wish. Ah, 
I, re I think I remember reading about that. I think I remember reading about that. Somebody was talking about like weird moments in Pokemon. Wait, who's this? What is that all the way in the top left? Is that another? Oh, it's another staircase. Or a ladder or whatever. Oh, it's Fire Doggo. At least you only have one Pokemon. I think I can take care of this. Kinda wish there was somebody in here who would heal me though. Dragon Rage is powerful, but it will never take out something in one shot. At least I can't get burned by that flamethrower. I love Growlithe, it's so happy looking. Oh, Golbat. What are you doing? No! Get away from me. Golbat! I went this way already, right? There's different uh, ladders here that I can explore. Another tiny Cubone. This cave is way too big, man. Another Slowpoke guy. Guarding an item. Random trainer. I don't want to battle anybody anymore. <laughs> a lot of people seem to be having all these Pokemon that are weak to water. So let's throw Aqua out there. Hopefully she'll get some more EXP. Some people say XP. I usually just say EXP. I've always been saying it. Do you guys say it any different? Should I capture a Dewpider whenever I get to the second island? Yeah, it's a cool Pokemon. And the second I say I should try something out with water types, I get this guy with a grass type. Not the best matchup. If only Gyarados could learn something with a flying type. I think the only, the only move it gets is Bounce, and that's either like a tutor move or something else. I wonder why they decided to not include abilities in this game. In the manga, which Pokemon was infused Mewtwo's DNA? Uh, what did it call itself? Wasn't there a uh, a Mew three in the manga? Technically, I can't remember what Pokemon was infused with its DNA, but I remember that it was. I remember that it called itself Mew three. So it sounds kind of fanficy, but it's not. Can't think of what Pokemon it was though.
The answer is Clefairy, and yes, it called itself Mew3. Clefairy? Why Clefairy? It's so random. Oh, I should've used Bite. I love that sound effect for Psybeam. Yeah, no. I don't know if I'll survive this. Oh, yeah, no, I did not survive. Rip Aqua, useless. Yeah, she did well. I just, I left her in on something that I shouldn't have. Use that twin needle. Or pin missile, actually. Sorry, my bad. Nightshade. Doesn't that do as much as the level? That wasn't that strong. Oh, God! Murdered! That Kadabra, poor guy. That was just one. One attack. I really like her design. It's, it's so cute. Cool. Free item. Oh, what are you doing here? I right, great. I got scared by Onyx, and now I'm going to have to battle this guy. Let's try a wing attack. I just want to get to this cave, to be honest. How uh, how much farther is the next gym after this cave? Anybody know? Oh, uh, what Pokemon was it? Oh, Flareon. Hello, Lucario Phantom. Welcome to the stream. Your fire spin is actually kind of strong when it first hits. And then it's like, subsequent hits afterwards are really, really weak. Goodbye, Flareon. My pride has an ace trainer. Oh, get me away from that Onyx. <laughs> okay, things popping up in front of me are really annoying. What was the last Pokemon I caught? That looks like an Onyx's tail or something. This, this like mound of rocks over here. Huh. That's uh, a Geodude. I don't want to deal with that right now. Let's just go up here. Oh, there's an item over there. I should probably go get that. As long as this Cubone decides to move. Another super potion. I don't think I really need it, but it's always nice to have. Ah, Cubone. Camper Leroy sent out Nidorino. Hello, Alyssa. How you doing? We started about an hour or so ago. I just want to get through this cave, to be honest, and then see how close we are to the next gym. Oh, wait. I am dying. What am I doing here? Let me roost. That is such a useful attack.
I could have sworn Poison Sting was one of those moves that hits multiple times. Oh, and I got poisoned. Everything wants to learn agility. But a, a lot of my Pokemon are already decently fast. There's no need. Have you ever played a Pokemon Ranger game? A little bit. But I don't remember much about it. Cubone! I don't care if you jump away. You can just jump right on off the screen. Man, that Cubone was so annoying. Wait, what happened with your rock rough? Hello, Jay from Mod, how you doing? Let's um Let's put Chloe in the front, see what happens. Yeah, I got a Gyarados now. It evolved yesterday. We got it to level 20 by just capturing a bunch of drowsy. Rage. Faint? Please use Fury Swipes on me. Or Faint, that's fine. I get a plus one attack still. Okay, yeah, no, for whatever reason, that's a really strong move. Oh great, my uh, my water type is gone. Uh, let's leave Chloe in and see what happens. I do have a plus one in attack and hitting it with a poison jab might KO it. Who knows? We'll have to see. Yeah, totally. Chloe's not afraid of no fire type. Hello, Alyssa. I thought I said hi before. How you doing? You are indeed out of Pokemon. <laughs> I need somebody to heal me. Like, are we are we close to the end of this cave already? Oh, wow. Okay, there it is. Rock Tunnel, Cerulean, Lavender Town. Oh, and there's a nice little item here. Pearl. We could sell this for monies. Speaking of which, when do I get the ability to, like, fly from place to place? I would love to go back to Pewter and go have a staring contest with that Slowpoke and make some monies. Oh, there's even more trainers. Amazing. Oh, no. Not you. Oh, no. Not you, too. Oh, he's guarding an item. At least there's a way to skip these guys. I just want to... Oh god, that atmosphere. I'm gonna have to change the thumbnail to this to just a bunch of, uh, Diglett Cave things. Not Diglett Cave, the Rock Tunnel and... Rock Tunnel and, like, um, what is this? What is this place called again? Lavender Town. Yeah, I have to change the thumbnail. Tomorrow will probably be Erica then. I was not expecting such a long little side thing before the next gym.
Pokemon Tower, become the spirits of Pokemon. Don't go disturbing things in the Pokemon Tower. Yes, this music. Sorry, I had to go to Route 8 just to see what was here. Another trainer. There's another trainer in the distance. You know what? Let's just battle her so that we can proceed. Hello, Shadow Red X. How you doing? Welcome to the stream. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mark. I just wanted to see what was uh what was going on around this this area. Yeah, I always thought that uh I always thought that Clefairy's ears were like all pink with just like the little brown tips. I didn't think it had like the black side. It looks like that ear got cut in half. But it is fairy type, right? Oh, it is definitely fairy type. Goodbye, Clefairy. Uh, you can get less EXP when you battle. And by the way, it's fine. Wait, EXP? You get less? What is that face? She's so angry. How many Pokemon had crushes on Ash's Pikachu bonus? Name them. At this point, I can remember Baneri and... There has to have been at least one or two more. I want to say that the, the number is three and I can remember Baneri. Um, did Togedemaru technically? Did Togedemaru have a crush on, on Pikachu? Yo, Storm, what's up? Go back, go back where? Celadon City to Lavender Town. Wait, Celadon? Celadon is uh the the area with Erica, right? See, am I allowed to go through here? Green tea, Togedomaru had a crush on Pikachu. Okay, so Togedomaru. Um Baneri. And I cannot remember the other one. David, if you'd like an intro, you can become a member and then tell me what you'd like for an intro. The command only works for uh, members. Yeah, Beedrill is a fine bug type. I love it's Mega. Maybe Maze Glaceon? Really? Yo, Crimson. Uh, do you go off to, you know what I mean, to the department store in Celadon City? They sell all kinds of things. It's very handy. So, like, am I allowed to just kind of glance over Lavender and, like, just go to Celadon here? Or is there, like, some story-driven, ah, I didn't want to fight you. I know, I know at first I said I was going to fight every trainer and get all the monies, but right now it's just kind of annoying. I just want to get to certain places. And now Yvette is getting in my way. Oh, hi Q. Where are you? Are you, are, are you like, in the basement? Yeah, Mega Beedrill is very OP. Oh. Get out of here, Raichu. Okay, maybe that wasn't the best thing to do. Thunderbolt. Oh god. Well, I, I kind of asked it like it was a question. Wait, what question? What Pokemon was this? The answer was only two, Baneria took it tomorrow. I searched it up. I thought there was a third one. Not gonna lie. I thought that there was a third one somewhere. But yeah, I can only name the two. I, I guess I was remembering Toga tomorrow, and I just felt like adding an extra one just to be safe if I was forgetting a third one. Ha, Doug Trio. Hello, Demon Fox. How you doing? 
Mega stones are really expensive. A whole 30,000 poker dollars and beating the Elite Four. How much money does beating the E4 get you? There is no amulet coin in this game, right? There's no way of having a key item that just gives you double money either. Ah, oh, good job, Aqua. Roughly 50k. I mean, that's pretty good. Dragon Tail. I'll forget Tackle. It's kind of weird playing Gen 1 while taking fairies into account. Because this Dragon Tail will, uh, you know, fairies will be immune to it. Oh, Sardar, you're playing uh, Sun and Moon over again? Uh, just compare it to Red and Blue and Fire Red and Leaf Green. I don't want to take any chances. I don't think the seal will outspeed me, but I still want to just go first and wreck it. Did you guys see that HP bar? I think it went, started going down before it even got hit. You could still hold items in Fire Red and Leaf Green, right? That was a good thing. I don't know why they removed items in this game. Please tell me that Celadon City is over here. Let me... What the... Is he not going to let me into the city? Do I have to go back? This bar Ultra Moon yesterday and decided to play it and I haven't finished Sun at all. Oh no. What made you go for um What made you go for Ultra Moon instead of Ultra Sun? Did you just want to have the other legendary this time? This game is so incredibly gen one. Okay, so you don't stop me. You know, uh, this is probably gonna regret this, but like, what do you say? Okay, well then, that's the game corner. Yeah, rocket, rocket game corner. Hmm. Where's the gym? Oh, hello there. Shouldn't I be able to reach the gym from here? No. I think it's that other place that has the little tree there. Where's the abilities in Fire Red and Leaf Green? Like, all the Pokemon have them. Like, like in Ruby, Sapphire, Emerald. Yeah, abilities were introduced in Gen 3. Wait, remove the poster. What poster? Fire and Leaf Green is Gen 3. That's why they have abilities. Yo, Spencer, how you been, man? Nice to see you around. Ah, uh, wait, what was it? What was he supposed to say? I have to show. Wait. What was the in Erica's gym? What did they want? I will show them Hamilton. It's cute. Super cute. Oh, oh, I have to show them a cute Pokemon. They really like Hamilton. Nice. I don't know. D did you show them a grass type too? Or did you show them? You showed them your Vulpix. I was like... I could imagine them hating your Vulpix because it would get rid of grass types with fire. Actually, this would be... Yeah, same here with Hamilton. This would be a good uh, time to use Chloe, actually, because everything in here should be grass. 
So poison should, in theory, be good against all these Pokemon. But a lot of things are like grass poison, so I don't know how that's going to go. Wait, is who a Tsundere? What did you say? Ah, oh, man. Oh, I have I have Chloe. I don't I don't care if they try to poison me. I'm just like my poison won't do as much damage as it normally would. But it does enough. Uh, poison, I think, resist bug. That's kind of unfortunate. I'll hit it with pin missile to see what happens though. Wow. Maybe I should go with Pin Missile more often. So far, Pin Missile has not been able to hit anything twice. They always get, like, nuked by it. Yeah, I know. And I kept hearing about people liking the uh, Hamilton musical thing. So, I just named it Hamilton. Why not? My favorite Bug-type Pokemon? I'd probably have to say Beedrill at this point, And then my second would be Volcarona. I really want to see a Bug-Ice-type, though. So, aside from the Nkata, is there another bug ground type? Is that, it's such a weird combination for just Nkata to have, and then it evolves and becomes bug, uh, bug flying? And bug ghost. Oh, this is in, um... This is not a poison type. This is... Execute is grass psychic? Or just grass? Either way, I'm going to hit a missile, see what happens. Oh, God. Okay, finally got two hits of pin missile in. Just grass, pure grass. I should have probably hit it with the, uh, the uh, poison jab. Grass and then grass psychic. Yeah, I thought Oddish was just grass and then it evolved into grass poison afterwards, like with Vile Plume and Gloom. But no, it's actually, it's actually grass poison the whole time, right? Same thing with uh, Bellsprout. Bellsprout, I could have sworn, was just pure grass. No. I tried to poison powder it the other day, and it just it didn't work. I don't know if maybe powder moves don't work on on grass types, but that was just so weird. Because I, I always thought that it was just pure grass. Uh, who knows? Yeah, I like glare. I don't know about that. Yeah, no, it says here Bellsprout types grass poison. <laughs> that is so odd. Sandy Cloak Wormadam is bug ground. Fermi is pure bug no matter what cloak. Yeah, I like the trash cloak one. It sounds so cool because it's just trash and then it's a bug steel type. Which is a really good type. The only pure grass in this game is Tangela and Execute. Thank you. Yeah, all the all the grass types have some sort of weird secondary poison thing with them. Uh, how much power does Vine Whip have? Vine Whip has only 45. They changed some of the uh, powers in this game. Didn't they change Mega Drain to the power of Giga Drain? Uh, execute, uh, execute is just grass, and executor is grass psychic. Apparently, crimson. Uh, yeah, it is a really good type, but it does have that fire weakness at times four. Like, I'm not saying it's without any flaws. Like, obviously, every type combination has an issue, unless you're like electric with levitate or something, and then your only weakness is mold breaker. Uh, hi, Fallen, watching you from my PlayStation 4 right now. Hello, Katie Sue. Haven't seen you in a while. How you doing? Yeah, I guess we're gonna have to go back to... Wait, do I have to go back to Lavender Town and do anything in there? Because I sort of just, like, skipped it. No! I just kind of... Oh, <laughs> I just skipped it and went to Erica. <laughs>
Really? That's not how it happened in Origins. He just saved Fuji and then he went on to the other gyms. I think. Pretty sure. That sounded like a sonic sound. What sounded like a sonic sound? You unlock flying after you have beat the Team Rocket's base in the game corner. These will be a balloon thing in front of the building. Oh, okay. So I actually get fly soon. Thank you. I've been wanting to actually fly around. I want to go visit that Slowpoke and babysit him again. You have to get the Silph Scope first. Um, right now I'm in the middle of trying to thrash Erica, so... What do you think about the game so far? I think the game looks really pretty. It plays pretty well. My only complaint is the one Joy-Con thing. I wish I could play with a Pro Controller. Like, it should be the same as docked mode. If I'm going to use the Pro Controller. Hello there, Erica. I mean, I'm taking my time with the game, but, like, a lot of people have already beaten the game. And, like, they're doing a bunch of other, like, shiny hunting or just other post-game stuff. Where, where, uh, what gym are you on? Oh, splendid. She said that, but she looks so angry instead. So many trainers in this gym. You know what? I'm a fighter because I like their character design. You would talk to me. Welcome to Celadon Gym. You better not underestimate the nice ladies here. Surprised Blaine isn't creeping around the corner here. Oh, splendid. Oh, great. He paralyzed me. I was hoping he'd hit me with an actual move. Hopefully this will boost my attack power. I resist that grass move, sir. I think I might need four hits. Oh, I'd only hit three times. GG. Good to hear Mew... Mew what? What are you trying to spell, Crimson? I get the point. Oh, you're trying to say Mewtwo. <laughs> he said Mewtwo. Hello, Tasha5. Welcome to the stream. How you doing? Okay, finally, this weeping bell goes down. I got to heal Chloe. Use like a paralyzed heal and maybe a potion or something. Just tearing through this entire gym, though. I am so proud. I actually didn't plan to keep Chloe the whole time, but she works pretty well. Oh, speaking of pure grass types... I can tow to one shot this with a poison jab. I'm at plus one right now. That Mega Drain will do not much to me at all. Looking at this tangle, it just reminds me of this one picture that uh, Q showed me online. It shows a bunch of like kids dressing up for Halloween as Pokemon. And you have all the cute, memorable ones like like Charmander, Pikachu, oh, Eevee. Yeah. <laughs> and then the fourth kid is just the Tangela, like a giant Tangela. It's like, what Pokemon do you want to be for Halloween? Tangela! The... Why, why, why don't you be one of the cute ones like all your other friends and brothers and sisters? No! I want to be Tangela! Just when you think somebody won't dress up as a certain Pokemon, they do. Have you ever seen anybody dress up as a Kangaskhan? 
yeah. They now call me Eevee Master Sammy. <laughs> If you um if you beat multiple masters here, can you uh can you have the Pokemon Center call you like a specific one or they, they will call you by the last one that you beat? The episode Iris and the Rogue Dragonite, which Pokemon was Dragonite fighting? Bonus, what caused Dragonite to fight the opposing Pokemon? I've seen that episode before, but I can't remember what it, I wanna say it's a it fought Drud again at some point. No? But I don't think this was the time where it fought the Drud again. What dragon? It was it a dragon that it was fighting? I have three paralyzed heal. I love how they didn't abbreviate paralyzed heal. They like they usually do like paralyze like P R L Z or something. Spacing issues. Oh wow, Chloe has way too much HP now. Now she needs a regular potion on top of the super potion, but now she's all good and healthy. Is it a Hydreigon? Maybe it was a Hydreigon, actually. The blue Twizzler Pokemon, <laughs> excuse me? Wait, are you talking about uh, Tangela? It's pronounced Zed. What's pronounced Zed? What is that animation? No, I'm laughing at the, the animation for Bellsprout where it like pops up and does its cry and then it flaps its little leaves. Yes, hit me with that weak razor leaf. The answer was Hydreigon. For the bonus, it was protecting a flock of P-Dove. Oh, it dodged. Wow, I'm sad. Wait, it knows Poison Jab? How do you learn Poison Jab? Bellsprout. Wow. Wow, wow. <laughs> it sounds like a shy guy. Why does Bellsprout sound like a shy guy? The Poison Type, remember this stuff. No, 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 I know that it's a poison type, but like, I didn't expect it to. What part of a Bellsprout is going to jab you? It's a stick and two leaves. And not even a stick, it's like a root. It are? They are? I was going to say it is, but but then there's multiple ones, so I said are instead. Yeah. So, wait, it, its leaves are toxic? Really? Why does she have another Bellsprout? Sprout? <laughs> Just three bell sprout. That animation is priceless, but why are there three? Oh, wow, wow. Feels so bad for these bell sprout. Last Lena. Oh, you. I don't need chop down. I can just roast these. Uh, what are these bushes? Thorns? Shrubs? Thorn shrubs. Bellsprout Master Lass. This is not the right way, is it? That's probably like the way to the beginning of the gym again. I am not going through this labyrinth of bushes. Again. Yeah? No, Damien, not right now. The what? Okay. Go! I believe that the the correct way was the other way, not this way. I think I see it. Yeah, it leads right there. I see her, uh, her kimono from the bottom. The top of the screen. Oh, wait, I have that much money? Hello? 85,000? I thought I was catching a lot more Pokemon than that. It's so pleasant. I thought she called you a peasant. 
She's just falling asleep in front of you. I'm a student of the art of flower arranging. And my Pokemon are all of the grass type. She sounds so high. She called it all of the grass type. Hello, chess player. Yeah, no, Erika was also falling asleep a second ago. She's got one pure grass type, and that should go down to this. Or Tangela can be bulky. What do I know? Sleep powder. Uh, please, no. Don't do that. I use Mega Drain. I should have used Rage. I wonder if it's gonna use a like a if she's gonna use a potion or something. I'm gonna use Focus Energy. Oh, she didn't use any items. Okay. Focusing. That was a crit. It did oh, come on. The one time that it doesn't hit me with anything. Weeds hate bugs. Will my attack go up since the last move I used was Rage? I don't think it will. Usually it goes up like right after I get hit. Aw, oh, Chloe, please wake up, man. This Tangela doesn't know any good moves. It's just no Sleep Powder and Mega Drain. You should wake up now. I hope. Yes. Now I get hit with Mega Drain and I become super powerful. But for real though, that rage did like absolutely nothing. Okay, so I do I do gain attack after she heals. That was a crit and a plus one. Um, if you have any extra, I'll, I'll take one, but... Oh, what? Guys? Okay. I'll keep battling, because I already set up. Where'd you put the other stuff? To the bottom? Oh, okay. That looks really, really good, actually. I don't know if I'll survive a hit from this thing. Moon Blast? Why does it know Moon Blast? I should have healed. That was that was too risky. You can change the title you're using at the game company in Celadon City. Master Trainer Help NPC. Oh. That's good. I would not want to be known as a certain, like, uh, master. <laughs> Metapod master. <laughs> so, wait, they call you, like, Eevee Master and then, like, your name, or what? Everybody leveling up now that, uh, now that Chloe's gone. Rip. Uh, I thought she had a Gloom as well. I don't remember her having a Vile Plume. But yeah, maybe the anime was different. Oh, that was kind of weak. A poison jab. Every time I see Weeping Bell. Wow, a crit. Every time I see Weeping Bell, I just picture the, um, the Weeping Bell from Starter Squad. <laughs> oh no. Challenge failed. <laughs> I 
I don't know why I didn't just do this with Sora. Like, that wing attack would have destroyed everything. Alrighty, Mewtwo, thank you for dropping by. We're gonna end the stream soon, anyways. So, thank you for staying for most of the stream. Hope to see you tomorrow when I stream again. Ah, uh, there goes Weaving Bell. Goodbye. I can see defeat. Uh, you are remarkably strong. Oh, she is pretty cute. A friend of mine has a real big thing for Erica for whatever reason. Uh, Rainbow Badge raises the level of Pokemon willing to listen to you to level 50 for Pokemon that you have received from other trainers. And here, if you'd like, please take this. You also Mega Drain. I could use this. I could use this a whole lot on Hamilton. Oh god, no. I keep on pressing Y to save while I'm in the start screen. I don't know if any of you do that because of the Ultra Sun and Moon thing. Do you do that? When you press X uh, to open up the menu and let's go, do you press Y to try to save like an Ultra Sun and Moon? Oh, okay. How do you press the B button while moving the stick? Oh, that's so weird. Anyways. Uh, best way to level up is by catching uh, chances. Yeah, I guess that's why they put them in there and made them so common just to uh, like grind for EXP. I'll try to catch a couple of... Wait, what? Okay. Oh. Wait, something cracked. What was that? Oh, okay. I was like, be careful. Okay. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. I'll be back again tomorrow, hopefully doing some, uh, what do you call it? Some of that. What was I supposed to be doing after this? The, 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 that town, Lavender Town. Lavender Town and the next gym. Although it feels like I have to do a whole bunch of other convoluted things before I get to do the next gym, right? Mike, you misspelled the thing. It's all right. All right, but good night, everybody. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you guys tomorrow.